Hi, my name is Tanya with Crafty Cake Shop. Today we're going to be learning how to use the three-piece teddy bear mold. So for this video, we're going to be using the three-part teddy bear mold. We'll be using the mini bow chocolate mold, also lemon extract, a silicone cup, candy color by Color Mill, Merkin's white chocolate, and gold highlighter, and a spatula, and a brush. So we're gonna start off by melting our Merkin's chocolate, which you can find in the description box below. We're gonna go ahead and put it in the microwave at 30 second intervals. We'll be right back. So this is what it looks like after microwaving it for 30 seconds. We're gonna go ahead and mix it around so we distribute the heat evenly. And we're gonna pop it back in the microwave at 30 second intervals until we get it to the consistency that we want. We'll be right back. So this is the consistency that we're looking for. And now we're going to go ahead and add our candy color by Color Mill. This is oil-based. You're only going to want to use oil-based products when working with chocolate. And I'm looking for a light pink, so I'm not going to put too much in there. It's a perfect color pink. Now we're gonna go ahead and grab our three part teddy bear mold. Now this comes in three parts. And if you see in here, there is a line. This is a measuring line, how much chocolate you wanna put in there. You can kind of see it there. All right, so let's go ahead and put our melted chocolate in there. All right, that's right at the line. And now we're gonna put, there you go. Now we're gonna put our second piece on and we're just gonna squish it down and the chocolate is going to distribute it evenly. And we'll go ahead and put the third one to help that out more. So you'll see the chocolate spreading around in the mold. And make sure you press that firm. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and pop this in the freezer for about seven minutes, and we'll be right back. Now we're gonna use our mini bow chocolate mold, and I'm using the leftover of our candy melt to make the chocolate bows. We're just filling up the cavity. I'm gonna make a few of these. And that should be as felt as much as we need. We're gonna tap it so that it goes in there evenly. And we're also gonna pop this in the freezer for about two minutes. All right, we just took our bows out of the freezer. It's been in there for about two minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it around and all we're gonna do is gently tap it on the surface and they come right out. Now we're gonna make a paint out of our highlighter using some lemon extract and our paintbrush. So to do so, I'm gonna go ahead and pour a little bit of our lemon extract into the cap of our highlighter. Just a little bit, because I'm only gonna cover three bows. And we're gonna add some of the highlighter to that. We're gonna create a paint out of this. I kind of want it on the thicker side. Now let's paint. We just pulled this out of the freezer. We had it in there for about seven minutes. Go ahead and turn that around. We're gonna take the first part off, turn it around and kind of stretch it out. It should pop right out. That's our teddy bear. Now what we have to do is peel back the center piece. So just be careful when you're working on this part.
All right, we'll just clean that up a little bit. Take this part off. And that's the teddy bear. Look how cute. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and put some highlighter splatters on him. All right, so now we have some highlighter here. I'm gonna use my brush. Gather a little bit on the brush and then we're just gonna tap it so that it splatters the gold. It gives it a nice little touch. Now I'm gonna pipe a little bit of chocolate on their ear because that's where I wanna place our gold bow. And this is gonna glue it together. Let's go ahead and put that there. And we have a cute little bear. All right guys, that's how we make our teddy bear using the three-part teddy bear mold. Be sure to subscribe to our channel, hit the notification bell so you can stay up to date with our videos that we post. And make sure to hit the like button. Thanks guys.